Okay, so I think I have to do a big escape here. I'm pretty sure the guards chase you and stuff, if I remember correctly. Do I have to find something to break this lock? Uh, Mar Mako of the Gray. No, Mako to the Gray. I don't know how to say your name. Ask, is this the first time playing? No, I've played this before, but only a few hours. So I'll probably recognize a bunch of stuff for the first few hours, and that's it. <clears throat> October says, crouch making, jumping still makes certain parts easier. British Gaming Black just cheered and said, wishing me a happy 10 years for providing with quality entertainment. Great to see you play a classic. Been watching you since the start. Through the highs and lows. Cheers to the future. Thank you very much. Of course, your question touches on one of the basic biological It's I also detect some unspeakable Do our benefactors really know what's best for us? Submissive! I got five gamer points for doing what he said. Will they ever deactivate the suppression field and let us read again? Allow me to address the anxieties underlying your concerns, rather than try to answer every possible question you might have left. First, let us consider the fact that for the first time ever, that? as a species, immortality in trouble. is ah. in our reach. This simple fact has far what are these people doing with this robot? requires radical rethinking and revision of our genetic imperatives. It also requires planning. Is this food ration? I think he's giving them their food rations. We're all like prisoners here. I find it okay. helpful at times like these to remind myself that our true enemy is... I want some food. Hurry up. Instinct was our mother when we were... You'll instinct. have to wait your turn like everybody else. Instinct coddled us and kept us safe in those hard scrabble years when... That's we my turn. Give me food. ...about a meager fire and started at the shadows that leapt upon the cavern's but inseparable from instinct... People are saying the game vo volume is still too loud. I'll lower it even more then. There, I lowered it even more, guys. It won't give me any food. I want food. What is this? Just become aware of its irrelevance. It won't give me any food. Well, fuck it. I can't get any food. I guess I'm going to starve. ...on our species. Instinct creates its own oppressors and bids us rise up against them. All right. Instinct tells us that the unknown is a threat rather than an opportunity. Instinct slyly and covertly compels us away ah, from out to the streets. And progress. Instinct, therefore, must be the city streets. It must be fought tooth and nail. God, so loud! This guy's fucking voice booming through the city. Service. The urge to reproduce. We should thank our benefactors for giving us respite from this overpowering force. They have thrown a switch and exercised our demons in a single script. I guess I can't get to, to Precinct 6. Let's get out of here. What's this is over here? <clears throat> turned our eyes toward the stars. Let me see 13. Nope. Will be shut off on the day that we have mastered. Another door. All these doors are locked and have freaking cameras on them. We no longer need it. And that day of transformation, I have it on good authority. Is this way? <clears throat> I guess so. All right. Finally! I don't have to hear that guy's voice booming through the city anymore. Doctor something they said his name was. Ah, look. Whoa! Big Walker alien in the background. So what's funny is I played Half-Life 1 Black Mesa Edition, right? But I only played it as far as it went. So I don't actually know what I missed. I don't know when the aliens actually got to Earth. And how they interact or how they integrate and all this stuff. But here they're, they're just, they seem to be like slaves, right? The aliens have been enslaved. This is how it always starts. First the building, then the whole block. They have no reason to come to our place. 
Don't worry, they'll find one. Huh. So they're looking for something on the block, huh? <clears throat> Lord Edmund, Edmund Blackladder, no, the only Half-Life 1 I ever played was Black Mesa. The, the, the fan-made remake back in the day, and I only played until that remake ended, and I never finished the game. Oh, Cupid Dal. Throw right in the window. How about some seesaw? Seesaw. Chairman, Chairman Caleb, so I'm really digging the new frame for the playthrough. Would you consider doing it more for future games if fans created them for you? Yes. As long as, like, for example, you know, the camera placement and everything is in a good spot. I agree the frame makes this playthrough look pretty good. So thank you to the person on the forums who posted this up for me to use. I appreciate it. And yes, I, I would absolutely consider using these in the future if more people make them. So there's a door there to go in, right? What's this over here? Anything? Nope, another lock. No way I'm sneaking by those guys. Alright. What's that? A shoe. Watch this. Fuck, I wanted to throw it at him, but I had no momentum. And later on, you get the gravity gun. That's when you can really shoot shit, like, real fast. High propulsion. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> Bounce it off the robot. I guess we got to go up. You still hear the stupid doctor's voice. What the hell? Oh, shit. Who are they looking for? Are they looking for me? I don't... Oh, no, he doesn't want me to go this way. Damn, that guy's getting fucked up. Was that you knocking? I didn't even know we still had a door. Oh, this guy's drunk. He's drinking a freaking wine or something. Oh boy, look. Oh, I thought you were a cop. He's one of us. He's one of us. I told you they'd be coming for us next. What the hell did they do? I can't take it anymore. Gonna be okay. What are we going to do? I think of something. Poor people are so distressed by what's going on. Hold on, I gotta use your toilet. There you go. Let's run their water. No. I wanted to turn their water on, take a shower. They won't let me. The wet bandits turn all their shit on. Now they won't let me. Throw the TV at the cops. Can you pick up the TV? Fire. Oh my god! I just took the TV. What the fuck? Fuck you! Comply with this bitch! Oh! Wow, he completely ignores the TV. <laughs> Attention, resident. Miss Cops detected in your block. Cooperation with your civil protection team. In here! Oh, really? What's going on? Head for the roof. There's no time to lose. The roof, huh? They're coming for us. Look out. <clears throat> Look out, man. Holy crap, they're coming for me. Get in here, quick. Holy crap, they're coming for me. I gotta run. Ember Swag is true. He said, not another Deus Ex. Dude, this game was way before... Well, then again, Deus Ex, the original Deus Ex was an old school game too, but... Nah, this game was is a classic, man. Oh, fuck! What the fuck? I'm getting shot! They're shooting my ass. 
Fuck. Oh my god, I gotta run. Petrol. Run! Keep running. Oh, they're shooting at me from the street. It's a good thing they're all terrible shots. Oh, oh, oh. oh here we go. Oh, fuck. Oh, no! Oh, boy. Ow. Got my ass beat. <laughs> Looks like that was a scripted event. Dr. Freeman, I presume. You better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. So apparently she beat the shit out of them herself. Dr. How? Look. This way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. How'd you beat up all these guys? Do you have a weapon for me? I'm Alex <laughs> Vance. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure he don't remember me though. Alex Vance. Yeah, a few words, aren't you? That's right. He's a silent protagonist. Gordon Freeman never talks ever. 